G'day guys, welcome back to Wombat Gaming. I've just come across a structure on a particular planet that I actually haven't seen before, which is kind of rare. I'm sure people have probably seen this one, but um, I haven't. So we're going to investigate it and see what it is. And I'm going to cut out any unnecessary running around. So we'll get over there and have a look. I'm playing on the very hardest setting and I'll show you what planet I'm on. I am actually looking for something else at the moment on this planet, which I'm going to do another video on if I haven't done that one first before this one. But uh, let's have a look at where we are and I'll show you. We are currently way out here on the far right of the solar systems area. So we, this is Hawking, so if you know where Hawking is, we're right out this way. So we're in this solar system and you can see all the way over here, this is where Alpha Centauri is. So it is a level 75 planet, so bear that in mind. Um, yeah, you my level at the moment is uh, let's have a look 86 so and i have some decent weaponry and armor and stuff so i can play this on very hard i have found this on a, a lower character i was testing a level 20, 20 character on this planet trying to find some information on another uh, another video and i found this uh, particular platform so i kind of have an idea of what's already there but i just wanted to just run it on very hard at a higher level just to see what we could get and show you guys what it is. So I'm going to head over there now and uh, we'll see what it is. Alright, we are just going to have to go up this way and have a look. There's a, a lift on this side. Essentially this is a mining platform I believe. So we're just going to come around this side. and going up to this platform and you can see there's there's no one here so normally you'd find some enemies but we have these guys so swarmling and a bunch of dead people and there's some pretty good loot here i did it on a lower level character of course and I, the loot that I got wasn't too bad from that as well. I'm going to skip through all the other stuff. I'm just going to go straight for the good loot. But you'll see, you know, what's going on here. There are like dead bodies everywhere. If you, uh, yeah, don't want this spoiled for you, you know, do not want to watch this. We, you know, have ammo and things like that. There's plenty of stuff. I'm just going to go for the main loot. Now we're going to come across some of these guys. Make sure that you have it on a lower setting. Uh, there is a case down this way, actually. Just a little one. Just some grenades and some credits. And we've got this guy here. So we'll keep going. Now these guys get... We get a lot of these guys soon. Uh, I don't think there was anything else in here. We've got some dead people everywhere. But... Um, a storage room here it's got some bits and pieces in here some more credits so we'll head keep heading now this door is one of the main enemies here so bear that in mind you can see there she is there Alright, quite a few of those as you can see. So it can bring you out onto this platform. We essentially want to get into that building. As you can see, more dead people. So plenty of credits lying around on this place. I'm just going to head on up. And there's more of these guys that we need to take care of. Alright, we have another 
Okay, it's just here. Nothing much in that one though. Oh, miss you. So from here, there's a room over here. We can check. Some more dead bodies. And you can see there is a uh, a door here for a and we got a um yeah a pack here that's always there. And this will change. It, I, I noticed it did change for me on a couple of different characters. So in this particular time, I didn't get anything terribly exciting. But on my lower level character, I actually got an advanced uh, spacesuit, so that was pretty good. So it does actually change and ro rotate roll that one. Uh, there's not much else in this room, if I remember. So we just uh, some more credits there. So we're going to head on up. Just follow the dead bodies. And you can go up that way if you want to, but there is another door through here. And do come across some more uh, things in this room. you got to go around this way. Another door just in here. So this guy, I just opened this up. There's just some ammo in here, so and a gun, so nothing exciting. And this is one of the main rooms. Everybody is dead in here, so there's no enemies as such. But there is a weapon on the counter here. It's this has changed every time I've reloaded this as well. So you are going to get something different here. So yeah, it's quite cool. And Obviously, you got some ammo and stuff on these benches. There's also a magazine here, so don't miss that one. This one happens to be here permanently by the looks because I've gotten it on the lower level character as well. It's a melee weapon one, but pick it up. I don't think anybody really plays melee, uh, melee in this game. Uh, that's about it for this room. We're just going to head this way. This is kind of cor a corridor that, that goes across to the main room. This is the main... like. They just keep coming out of this room, so there's quite a few enemies to get rid of in this room. So don't go rushing in there too fast. I will come down the stairs more, I think, if I recall. There we go. I think there's still some more maybe but this is the main loot chest here and there's a bunch of people around but you can see uh there we go that this change obviously different for you but there's some stuff in here that i don't particularly want myself but it does change up and obviously there's lots of bodies around the place that you can check out as well there is um a lot to explore here still so i've just rushed you through to the main area so there is this platform that you can head out on and we'll see we've got some more dead bodies, more credits. And you can't head down, but I did find something. Make sure you always have a good look around. I headed up this way. But there's the like to put things in the most random spots. And you can see if you get up here, there's a another case over that way. So don't forget that one. And we'll just have a see what's in that. Uh, this time, uh, Bridger. Not too bad. So it depends on what you're after. But um, yeah, so there you go. So that was a quick run through. Obviously, there's still a lot. You can search these rooms and go through every single body and work your way up. I just kind of rushed up here. But uh, that's uh, a new place that I haven't been to. And I thought I'd just show you guys. So keep an eye out that and come to this planet because I haven't seen it on any other planet, to be honest. Uh, this planet is actually really good for leveling up. I did come here with my, a level 20 character just to test something out. And I managed to level up like three levels literally in a space of like 15 minutes in one of these bases. Not this particular base, but a different one. Uh, yeah, so guys, thanks again for watching. Uh, hit that like button if this was helpful in any way. And consider subscribing. Going to be doing more Starfield content as I always do. And I'll see you on the next video. Thanks again, guys.